Hi everyone, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sketching a rooster using charcoal, and my reference picture is from Pixabay. I love charcoal. One mistake and you can just wipe it away and continue, as you just saw there. And there. And there again. I generally start off with a soft charcoal stick and once I finally get the proportions right I block in a basic value and give it a wipe over with uh, some kitchen roll. I pay special attention to the head, a combination of the soft charcoal stick, a charcoal pencil and I use my paintbrush and a blending stump for different blending effects. I want this to be the most detailed part of the entire bird like a main focal point. I pick out some detail with the charcoal pencil and start to build up my values using the soft charcoal stick. When it comes to drawing and painting I rarely stay in one area and gradually move on to the next area. I kind of work on the artwork like a controlled madman. I want to work on the piece as a whole especially in the beginning stages of creating the drawing or painting where you're kind of working on feeling for the subject and you're totally involved in capturing what you want to showcase. I use my blending stumps quite a lot to draw with. It gives me that mid-tone to play around with and I can reload it with charcoal by rubbing the nib gently on a really dark part of the drawing and almost kind of paint with it. Drawing with charcoal really gives you an advantage uh, when you want to paint. Uh, for example, it teaches you the importance of values. I'm constantly squinting my eyes to understand where my darkest darks go, as well as my mid-tones and highlights. I'm also trying not to overwork this. It is a sketch after all. Charcoal is very similar to oil paints. In a way, I mean, they both have some similar principles. You're able to move and adjust elements where needed, and you can blend the medium quite easily using a variety of objects. Same as I would do in an oil painting. Drawing and painting go hand in hand, and as my paintings, I want that loose vibe within my drawings. I want certain parts of my artwork to be detailed and other areas sort of unfinished. Creating detail without actually creating much detail is the aim for me. I love these sketching exercises. This one took me about two and a half hours and it was an absolute joy to draw and I'm already looking forward to the next one. Thanks a lot everyone, I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that little bell to be notified for when I upload my next video. Have a great day and take care for now.